The system must be vented and switched off for this procedure. First, to remove the Q-Jet, remove the source by moving the two black levers down and pulling the source out and away from the system. Take the curtain plate and gently pull away from the system and twist if needed. Take care as the plate may still be hot. Remove the orifice plate by pressing in the two black push-in locking pins located as shown. The orifice plate will move out a little and carefully pull away the orifice plate. Use caution as the orifice plate may still be hot and it is very fragile. Before removing the Q-Jet, check the position of the locator knob, usually on the bottom left side of the Q-Jet, then pull the Q-Jet out. To clean the Q-Jet, first remove the O-ring, then using the circlip pliers, remove the circlip holding the lens in place and then use an allen key to remove the two small hex bolts and remove the lens. Take the Q-Jet and using a swab and methanol or IPA as solvent, push it through in between the rods and repeat several times and dry down with nitrogen. Then take the lens and wipe with methanol or IPA. If needed, 1200 grade micromesh can be used to remove stubborn stains. If using micromesh, rinse thoroughly with methanol or IPA and dry with nitrogen. Check the Q-Jet for any dust. If any is present, rinse with methanol and dry down again. Then replace the lens by putting the hex screws into position and then put the circlip into place as shown. Then tighten the hex screws. Replace the Q-Jet, orifice plate, curtain plate and the source as shown.